Let's be real, I'm very conflicted about Robert Downey Jr. coming back to the MCU as Doctor Doom. And it's not like Robert Downey Jr. is a terrible actor, but man, this is a very interesting fit. Like, I am interested in Doomsday for merely the fact of seeing Do Robert Downey Jr. as Doctor Doom. I don't know. I mean, obviously he might not be the best fit, but we'll have to wait and see. People don't really seem to like it so far, but I don't know. I'm intrigued, and I... That was not the news I was expecting out of Comic-Con, but hey, the MCU likes to shake things up. And time to listen to the what the boys gotta say about this. I think it's a pretty almost bad last minute resort after um, things with Jonathan Majors and Kang just didn't work out. And you know, it seemed Doctor Doom was a good was the obvious last resort they would do, like because he's like such a big villain, but I generally think the idea of bringing him back as Robert Downey Jr. might not be the best route to take, even though I do love um, Downey. Like, I love him in Oppenheimer. I love him in a lot of other things I've seen. But, like, I generally don't think it's... Um, I generally think it's, like, a really bad last-minute, uncreative decision. Like, especially for, like, that character who has so much ties to Romanian descent that the last two movie adaptations have uh, fumbled with and just, you know, completely ignored. So, like, them doing it again and just completely ignoring that part of the character, it just, you know, it puts it, it like, you know, it's very off for me. So, like, you know, and Downey's probably going to be temporary. Like, this is probably, like, a you know variant from the fantastic four universe that's going to be in the uh new movie but still like i really i i almost don't vibe with it but i'll see how it plays out like i've never been so conflicted on a uh casting before like that i i am still very very conflicted i i don't know how to feel about it um could the mcu pull it off maybe you know i i definitely don't doubt in uh uh, Robert Downey Jr.'s acting ability, that's for sure. I'm sure he'll pull it off, but I don't know. I, I'm I'm going to have to wait and see until they release some clips or something of him actually acting as Doom. I'll say uh, for Robert Downey Jr. again, I think his, his performance, because he's going to play Dr. Doom, I think his performance is going to bring more like, I'll say like from Oppenheimer and with a little bit of Tropic Thunder. That, that is a vibe I can definitely see from Robert Downey Jr. Once he's gonna suit up as Doctor Doom. Like, a more serious uh, serious acting from, from Robert Downey Jr. And also bring a lot of emotional part for, for, for Doctor Doom. Though the real question is, how long do you think they're gonna have him keep that mask on? <laughs> Just, I don't know, it's like, with those type of stars, you really like, they really love to show their face a lot you know you see like tom holland spider-man or uh you know especially iron man like you always have to see their face you always have to see them take off their mask and it's like the cg nanotech was always like you know there for that and it's just yeah it's probably gonna happen with doom and it kind of upsets me to be honest <laughs> 